He ate the small mouth. We've made it, where we're gonna be staying for five nights, a place that has the biggest muskie I've ever seen, the biggest muskie I ever have a chance to fish for, which is the beautiful French River. We're gonna be here for five nights, four full days of fishing, mostly muskie. We will take some breaks to go after smallmouth and pike and stuff, but I'm looking forward to it. Should be an awesome trip. I'm using 15 pound uh, leader, and if I get cut off, I just want to bite right now. If I get cut off, I get cut off, you know? See spinning back through the weeds? You know this. There we go. Yeah, that's a good fish, P. You see that? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a good fish. Pretty good fish. Gonna make the weeds not just a normal pike, but no, he's good. No, good that's pike. that's yeah. better than the one yesterday. They, they they look so big in this water. That's a nice that's a pike, pike, dude. Come here. Oh my God, that's that's a lot bigger. Yeah, maybe thirty. Yeah. Oh yeah. Bring them to me. Bring them to me. Johnny! Let's go, baby. Got a bite. 29. Biggest fish of the trip so far. Hit a spinnerbait. We're still on it. I'm looking at weeds straight ahead of me. We're still on it. Look at right ahead. There's weeds right here. Bunch of them. It's lumpy. It's a lumpy ridge. This ridge is El Choglamine, John. So, so you should catch a fish 100%. Oh, did you see a muskie? Did you see that huge muskie just came up? Dude, I caught the bat. I wasn't even looking. I look back. I see huge fish. Huge fish just came out of those weeds for the glider. Ah, uh, all right. Doesn't feel weather doesn't feel real musky right now, so I'm gonna get on this spinnerbait program. Been watching these why guys. You, why are you doing that, Patrick? Been watching these guys catch too many uh, pike on a spinnerbait, so I'm gonna join them. Bait right here. Look at all these minnows right here. Yeah, you want a half they, I got it. Oh yeah, I'm on a half. Look, minnows everywhere right here. Big school minnows. Half ounce spinnerbait. Let me get a let me get a pike. That was when the attack comes. That was too shallow. We got, Matt got bit right before it got shallow. Now we're gonna get bit right after. Get him up, get him up, get him up. Grab the spool if you need to. He's just kind of, turn the trolling motor to help. He's coming, slowly. He's coming. He's going to take off. He's big. Big fucker. Yeah, he is big. Big fucker. Careful, don't even. Over here, over that's here, over here. That's a, that's a, that's a huge pike. That's a huge pike. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get him ready. Huge pike. <laughs> that's a massive pike. Oh my God. Look at that thing. That is a lord. He keeps catching them on three ace. Smaller blades. But he just put so much slack into it. Straight ahead, I couldn't catch up. 
Got him. Get out of there. He's sticking in that. Well, it's a largemouth bass. It's a really? nice largemouth. Big bass. Holy oh. crap, dude. Man, dude. Uh, oh, yeah. Boom, look at that. That's a nice bass right there, that buddy. Okay, I'm here with Johnny Boy, and we are on our annual float trip. We're gonna be hitting some hidden water, some hidden lakes that are separated by rapids. No boats can get to them. These fish are rarely fished for. And as we approach the rapids, we actually have a whopper plopper trolling from the back, which actually already picked up a pike. Cool. I got a fish counter here. We're up to one, and we haven't even started yet. All right, so this is our first set of rapids here. Looks like we're gonna take that middle section where it's a little bit smooth and then just try to avoid this rock right here and then we'll be smooth sailing hopefully i don't think it's worth taking the gear out so hopefully that's not a mistake uh let's go straight this is perfect right here yeah it's perfect right. right a little bit to the a little bit to the right is perfect i think And then to the right, uh, to the right. Whoa! Whoa. We go <laughs> oh, okay, we did it. What do we want to do now? Uh, Could we fish at all? Yeah, maybe we'll fish a little bit. Oh, that's not bad. So number five. Let me see him. Canadian wild smallmouth. Chunky. They're eating good out here. No doubt. Green bucket. <laughs> you gotta love that dude. When, it, when it's, they're like, it's against the current swinging around, they hit it, it's just so evidently. Huh? I feel like I want to try a different jerk bait. Make an X. I got one right here. Deep Lord. No. I got other ones too. A regular X. And regular X mark the spot. Look at that. Oh, shallow deep, shallow deep, shallow deep. Oh, it was on. I'm standing. Oh, oh my God, did you, you see that? Where was it? I mean, I'm not sure. <gasps> there he is, there he is, that's a pike. Man, that was aggressive. You see that shit? Not bad. Not bad at all. You got him. Yeah. Dude, he came up like He cooked it. He came up like twice. 
Dude, he hit it like three times. Get out of there. There he is. Oh. Oh my god, nice small mouth right there. Where? Stop. Got him. Big, big, big smallmouth right here. <laughs> that was sweet. That was awesome. <laughs> Sight fished. That's a good one too. Look at him. He was just cruising. He was on a cruise mission. Intercepted. Oh, there's another one with him. Same size. All right, I'll get him. Yeah. <sighs> There he is. Nice smiley. Slow yum. Slow in 10 feet or more. You hear this? Got him. Musky, musky on the smallmouth. Eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. Go ahead. There he is. John, grab the stinger. Grab the stinger. Grab the stinger. Grab the stinger. It's behind me. It's behind. It's behind me. It's behind me. Oh shit! He's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. It's on the. It's on the rock. It's on the rock, dude. It's right behind me. Or it's. Maybe I put it back in the boat. It's a musky. He's gonna eat it. He ate it. He ate it. He ate it. Get the net. Get the net. We might be able to land him, dude. He ate the smallmouth. We might be able to net him. Net him, quick. He's gonna fight it for it. He's gonna fight for it. Get down here. Run. All right. Playing him easy. Get that net in the water. Net in the water. Okay. Ready? Ready? Get it in the water. Fully extend. Fully extend. Yeah. He's coming? No, he's off. There he is. I'll sting him. Oh my god. Pat, he's still hungry. Dang. Dude, he ate, he ate his smallmouth. He ate my smallmouth that we fought him for a minute. We thought we were going to net him. Oh, the canoe, Pete! <laughs> Wait, hold on, I got it, I got it. <laughs> got him. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Dude, same clip. Same I know it will. <laughs> to me. Get the net. <laughs> Get the net. Bruh, you're gonna send it to Timbuk. I can't, this is where it's going, dude. How you do this? Yeah, both Ned rigs. Ned rig double. That's our line. Right there. Right there. That's the money shot. That's the money shot. All right, just stay here. Forward. Right there. And then we got to go left of that big one. Kind of. 
Executed. Executed. <laughs> <laughs> Smooth as butter. Smooth as butter. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> that was the right line. I told you that was the right line though. All right, we just finished our float trip heading back to the lodge. We got 59 fish, mostly bass, mostly on jerk baits and Ned rigs. We did our float trip. We tried for the muskie here. So far, just swipes and follows, but we got a major weather change. It's now 10, 20 degrees colder and totally overcast, basically for the rest of the trip. So we're hoping that turns them on and they start eating properly. Right, right? Sound good? Right. Oh! Um, it is a, what, it's a whatever pipe. <laughs> were, were you saying, oh, in case? Yeah, I thought, I was like, it's possible. It's possible he was a T-Grow. Alright, come on. Get him off and get another one quick. Oh, did you see that? Did you see that? They're, dude, get in, get in the water, dude. They're turning on. They're turning on in a big way. He, he just flipped out of the water on it. Dude, why would you not get my get get the one that just flipped on me? Oh, yep. What is it? Yo, yo, what? I don't know. He's doing musky cut type of stuff. I gotta burn this thing. Is it? Uh, yeah, yeah, it is. This way, this way, this way. Down now. We got a musky. <laughs> First musky, just a little guy, but hey, it's a musky. That's what we were going for. Really spunky fish. Gonna release some now. And there he goes, off to the deep. One musky down. That checks that box. Now let's get a bigger one. Yeah, uh, I mean, coming up the pool. Just 20 more feet, or maybe, maybe 40, 50 more feet forward. <laughs> That's when I right in this. All right, here's where we need to fish in a serious manner. This is when it actually might happen here, fellas. We got to sit here and you got to work this bait with a little bit of extra pizzazz. So you can really coax that big, wise old gal into taking a nip. You really got to focus in and you got to say, hey, I'm not like the other fishermen. I'll give you a little fanfare. A little twitch, twitch. A little pause, pause. And then maybe something that surprises you. Like a little twitch, twitch, twitch pause. And that's how you really, really get them to go. Mm. On your 38, the first musky you caught last year. Yeah. What was its strike like? Dude, crazy. The whole fish came out of the water and missed it. I did one more twitch, and then boom, she nailed it again. <laughs> it was crazy. Double tap it. Yeah, double tap, dude. See, that's an attitude that they're just in. Oh, that's dude. the attitude you need them to be in. Yeah. Oh, got him, got him. Huge fish, huge fish, huge fish. Come on. That's the one. Do you see that thing? It's so good. I'm bringing it over to this side of the boat. I don't know why. Okay, come over this side of me. On this side of me, I'm gonna bring it to you if I can. All right. I think it's the issue. There we go. I'm trying to let him pull drag if he needs to. Oh, come on. Oh, he's coming up. Come on. That's a good one. Okay. Yeah, okay. I saw his whole back out. I was like, oh my god, it's huge. Right, this side. Oh, that's a good one, dude. Yeah, come on. I can't reach her over there. Okay. 
Where are you going? Where are you going? This side, this side, this side, this side. Get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. This might be it. Go! No, no. no. Okay. Oh, baby. All right. Uh, maybe this side? Are you sure? You don't want to bring it right back here? All right, right back, right back here. <clears throat> here we go. Here we go, here we go. You're, You're fine, fine, dude. She's hooked good. She's hooked good. Okay. Um, yeah, you got it. Yeah, baby. Yeah, brother. Yeah, brother. There she is. Oh, fuck, the seat's in the way. Beautiful fish. White stinger. Oh my god, what a fat lord. 45 and just a. Yeah, 45. 45. All right. There she is. Going in. Oh, what a beast. What a beast of an animal. Oh my god, the sides on that thing. Might take a second. Big go. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> awesome. Here, let me let me uh all right, so far just an update. Caught two muskies today, both on the white stinger. Absolute unit media white stinger. And just like that, we're back here in Pennsylvania. I'm editing the video. I've had a great trip. Those muskie are a challenge, but there are bigger fish in there than I've ever seen or caught anywhere else, including my personal best a number of years ago. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next one.